Hey guys, welcome back. We are now here to we're here battling Watson again. We're going to give him another attempt. Um, if I remember the last series I did in the Hoenn region, I had took a couple of attempts to beat Watson, so uh, <clears throat> I'm not really shocked and horrified that we're struggling with him this time. But I'm going to go at him with Lawler this time because Lawler's got a seven-level advantage over his, his early Dragonairs, so. The logic exists that Lawler should be able to wreck him. He lied. Right, let's heal Lawler up because if we don't, he's gonna die. We don't want that, do we? So he's using super potions. Let's get him to waste the super potions on Pokemon I don't have special specialist killing strategies for, like his Dragonairs. I want to be able to wreck his uh, his legend, his psychic ones with bite, and you cannot bring them back. So I'm happy with this tactic. I think this will work. At least that was the intention. It didn't, but let's go, Ambrose. Sludge. Sludge is a really good move. I'll just say that now. Come on, Ambrose, hold your own, buddy. Soda pop. Uh, he hit me with two, two, uh, two, slug, two attacks. I got hit with two attacks. I got the better of that. And here comes Latios. So this now, obviously, he's got a psychic type, but we may as well. Let Ambrose hit a sludge attack and try and do some critical. He's got a super potion. Let's hit him with another sludge attack. Dragon Breath will knock out Ambrose, but it's time to go in with Lita. Go to Lita. And use Bite. Our dark type attack is super effective against his psychic elemental. And down goes Latios. And finally, he's ending off with Latias. So we've got to be uh, a bit careful here. Here's another soda pop. Whoa, okay. Stop doing critical hits now. Come on. Choosing Wish, great. We'll be able to hit a bite attack. Maybe one more. It failed. Bite down. Oh, come on, really? We almost had you. We almost won. We did! We won! We beat Latias, yes! We have beaten Watson. Now what, what TM's he gonna give us? You got the dynamo badge, but I'm more interested in the TM. Because you never know what the move's going to be. We've got TM34. Shock, it's supposed to be Shockwave. And we got him. We got the old man's phone number. But it was ass. It was low kick. We could teach that to Sherry or to Lawler. I'm going to teach it to Lawler. Actually, think about it. Hang on. Yeah. I'll give it to Lawler instead of Peck. So let's heal up and advance with our day. We can smash up rocks, which means we're going to Ferran Turf to go and help the boyfriend get himself get himself some loving from his girl, his lovely girlfriend in Rustboro. So we'll go and do that, and I'll be right back in a moment. Sorry guys, had a slight uh, mishap. Either way, <coughs> let's get on with things. We got Rock Smash, which means we're going to Varan Turf, where we can smash up that rock and let that let that lovely couple have lots and lots of sex in a field full of flowers. So let's go and make that happen. Because we do believe in true love, don't we? Wow, you shattered that boulder. Show you how much I appreciate it. I'd like you to have this HN. A 
And now we can leave. Facing a Cacnea on the way. But we've, we've freed it up so that, that those two can get through this cave to see each other. Let's go and visit their house because Wally's there as well, so... <coughs> we'll, battle, we'll battle you again one day, Wally. And that's it, really, so... We'll go north and... Um, We'll head northwards now and continue on our little trip. On our little trek. I do want. I'm hoping to see some more Pokemon we can catch soon. Because we've only got five Pokemon in our team. I usually have six by this point, but. Lots of trainers. I'm going to try and avoid them and battle them all off screen. Because, uh. I want to advance and battle them people off the screen is more is easier for me, so got a double kick anyway. What's a grass type? What am I doing? Use poison moves, clearly. Um Poison Sting. Grass types don't like poison. <laughs> Logically. Got a bay leaf's a good one to see. Johto starter. Loom, of course. We we'll rush in a poison sting there as well. Oh, this is part poison, isn't it? So, um, yeah, I think we want to go for something. <coughs> I think we want to go for something else here. Go rock smash. Poison point got you. Double kick there. You'll take a suffer you'll take a stuffing from our poison point. Oh crap, leech seed. Whoops. Just mana double kick knocked you out anyway. Picnic at Irene. So we're, he we're heading to uh, He had to be standing in the middle of the road, didn't he? He's got a far fetch though. Let's just double kick it into orbit. Smack. Smack. Oh, Fury attacks with some damage, but we have, we're paralyzed anyway, so. Leer attack and smack. Smack. Up to 25, Sherry. Nice work, my dear. I'll go into the sandstorm because we ain't got the go goggles yet. But there then. Wild Pokemon on the route. Wild Zapdos! <laughs> yeah, I want to get away from that. Come on. Fine, I'll knock it out. Rock Smash. Lola Go. No kick. Horn attack. Horn attack. Ah, oh, we got to be poison point. Great stuff. Nice chunk of experience there for Lola. A wild Don fan. to paralyze it anyway. Is that burst again? Got no poison types on this route. So this is a singing picnicker. It's got a dust clops. Lita, you got this. Bye. Bye. Picnic has got ghost types. The bite will cover it, so.
So um, Team Magma are blocking the top to Mount Chimney. Now we need to get um, Moonstone so that we can evolve Pokemon, which is good. So in a couple of episodes, we might actually have a Nido, Nido King or Nido Queen. But most likely Nido Queen because we are holding off Lawless Evolution until the right moment. Just because I, uh, I want a certain move that he gets at a reasonably lower level if you do it in, um, if you if he learns it as a Nido Man. So that's why we're holding off his evolution. For those of you who don't know. It's it's a uh, oh screech. No. I don't need screech. No. Alright, we, uh, we're gonna have to battle him anyway. I was hoping to avoid this guy, but I'm probably going to go back off screen and battle all the trainers we skip past anyway. Shedinja! Good thing we got Lita on the part with the bite attack, you know. But Shedinjas aren't a problem. But yeah, I am. Um, <coughs> I'm, I'm really enjoying this series. Um, it's been a long time since I've played Pokemon. So, it's good to be playing it again. Now, what are we going to find in Fiery Path? Uh, Mag Cargo? Can easily be beaten with a couple of quick bites. Um, what, what are we using? We'll stick where we are until we find a Pokemon Center or a Healing House. I think there's like a grandma's healing house coming up, so um, we'll be alright until we get to there, I think. And then we can heal up, and then we can start working on Lawler again. Because I think Lee is now actually a higher level than Lawler, which means Lawler, Lawler can start battling again. I'm going to stand here, and I want to get them, I want to double battle. I wanted a double battle. Oh well, we'll have to fight him individually. He's got a Magnemite anyway. So we've got a bite attack. And again. Knock out that Magnemite relatively quickly. And then the Lekid. Come on, Luther, hang on. Oh, one hit KO, not bad. Anything wild here? Nope, still, still the same route, so still that doses. Uh, that's where we want to go, that little house there. That's like a healing, um, healing house, so... We can go in there, speak to the old deer. And let's sort out our party then. Right. So Lawler's level 27. So yeah, Lawler, yeah, Lawler, Lawler is actually close on being one of our weaker party members now. So we'll let him train for a bit. 29, 26, 25. So Lawler, yeah. Uh, I want I want to train up Lawler because I want I want Lawler to learn uh, learn that sludge bomb move, especially since we could well have uh, the item we need soon. The raspberry. <laughs> so let's just pick all the berries and um, and then piss off because there's no time stuff in this because we're using an emulator so. We may as well pick the Owen ber Owen berries and stuff. As I said, I'm probably going to go and battle in all these trainers off camera, but... 
cool trainer Brooke has sent out a Starmie. And a horn attack. As strong as water gun's gonna be against me, I need the I need the experience on Lawler. Something like level 30, I think he learns a move I want. Then taking the other stone off him and I'll let him evolve. Yeah, time for switch because she's a psychic trainer. Go, Lita! Bite attack. Bite attack. Can Lita learn crunch in this generation, I wonder? I should double check that. Because that would be useful, crunch. Jinx flinched, so we'll bite it again. Bite down onto its hair or something. Let's just pop back and see the old deer for some more healing items. So we've got heal Pokemon. So we will be just using her as like a portable Pokemon center for the time being. Might be new route, new Pokemon here. Yeah, look, Wild Type Lotion. Let's knock it out quickly, just because um, we could do the experience on, on, our, on our good boy, on our good, good little Nidor and Lawler. Level twenty-eight. Wild Moltres. Stones, man. Wild Corsolas? I'm not sure what level we do need Lawler at, but I'll know the move once he learns it, so. I want to go up here and double check the items that are around because. Max Ether. Wild type let's say it's a this looks like to be a fire route anyway. The plan is to come back and, and uh, battle a bunch of these trainers off camera anyway. I don't think Abra is gonna have any moves, so we're not gonna with a quick kick. We've got Celebi though. Which is part grass type, it's a poison thing. Got it poisoned, good stuff. May have recover. That's not gonna stop the poison, is it? A heal bell, dude. So recover and heal bell is like the perfect combo. But Celebi doesn't appear to have any physical attacking moves. Uh, any attacking moves. So it's a defense, it's a defender, but not an attacker. Eventually, though, it's move, one of its moves will fail. Oh, I just got confusion, and it knocked Lawler out! Bloody hell! Okay, go Ryder. That's it. Great acid all over its face. And he's got a Chimeco. I didn't know that was in this game. China Co. I thought it was Gen 5. But either way, acid attack! Good boot. We're not far from the town now, so. So let's get over there. Worm pull. Here we are, we're in that town now. 
Let's go to the Pokemon Center and we can pick up a random egg from the old guy in the thing. And now, obviously, that could be a, um, a poison type. We don't know until we find out. So, we'll go and. I thought he was in the sand here, wasn't he? I could have sworn that there's like a. At least I thought there was. There is, isn't there? Oh yeah, that's the other one I think. I don't think that's in Lava Ridge, is he? Now this guy gives you the TM that Peach's raw, but... It probably won't be raw. No, we've randomised the... TM, so is Zap Cannon. Like I said, trainer battles all off camera. Well, unless unless we unless they catch us unawares like that one, of course. But the other ones we'll do off camera just for the sake of um, leveling up more than anything. Which is Horn Attack on the main key. No point using a fighting type move on it because it is a fighting type itself. Got a poly rare, so this is a fighting trainer. Whoa, submission already, not bad. So we'll use horn attack and knock it out. Rock smash, so we can smash that. See, I, I want to do this stuff here because this is the place where we can find um, moonstones. So I do want to. I do want to make sure to take great attention in hunting out this place. So we've got a twin battle, a battle, a double double battle here with twins, senior and junior, Nido King and a Pupitar. So we'll use low kick on the Nido King and acid on everything but those things. The acid hits everything. We managed to poison the Pupitar. Uh, let's go for horn attack on the Pupitar and follow up with poison no, sleep powder on the Nido King. We want to knock it out, but uh, we obviously don't want it to be able to beat the shit out of us as well. So, follow up with Horn Attack and Absorb. Absorb might do some damage actually. It's part ground trap, isn't it, you know, King? It's important to keep Lawler alive, so. Oh, we nearly knocked out the Nido King with Horn Attack. Ooh, hang on, Lawler. Down goes the Nido King. And the boys. Oh, Lawler, no! Ambrose, come back. Oh, if you'd have held on one more turn, Lawler, you'd have got all the experience, man. Quite irritating on this route just because of how far back we are from the Pokemon Centre, but we'll be able to do it, of course. So we'll head all the way back to the centre and heal up. We talked to Woman the PC as well because that's Lynette, so. I think we get, we get an item or something from her, so we want to do that, of course. I'm going to check out these towns and stuff eventually, but for the time being, I just need... Um, I just need more... 
I just need a moonstone. I just want to try and get a moonstone in this episode. Poison sting. I'm gonna double check off off um, camera what level we're getting Lola to, but it's something in the 30s, I think. Yeah, it's Random bell done. Put it down. Uh, that brings over here. Double battle! A Venusaur and a Poliwhirl. Lola and Ryder are the perfect people to take care of that. Poison Sting on the Venusaur. Absorb on the Poliwhirl. Watering a weed is a great idea, of course. I'm sure you know this. Absorb attack! Yeah! Good hit. Venus is obviously using its, its um, absorbing power, so we'll use horns. And absorb on the Poliwhirl. Horn attack virtually killed the Venusaur. The bubble attack's going to do some damage to both of us, but the Vine Whip attack won't be too effective. Absorb will wipe out that. Rides up to 25. And a Wall Rain. Again, I think Horn Attack and Absorb Attack. Horn Attack finishes off Venusaur. Chikorita, so it's another Grass type. Chikorita is still benefiting from the Horn, the, uh, the attack set up by Venusaur, the uh, Leech Seed. But of course, Wall Rain is still taking. He's still going to be. He's, he's the encoring Rider, so Rider's going to do the move that I was going to get him to use anyway. Now, Chikorita is still going to be a benefit from us, but we're hitting more damage in the turn than it can take, so. Let's just knock out the Chikorita to get rid of the loot the 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 soon, I think. Horn attack. Oh, Lola's down. Okay, go Sherry. So that should take Wall Rain down. And down it goes. So we smack both of those two about. I do need one to open this for a minute. We can set up a little secret base there, I think. But we're going to go around him and do some quick healing. Oh, everyone's alive, just all these down. We'll be alright with that. Because this is Meteor Falls. Pretty sure I can get moonstones in here, so But we'll do that in the next episode of Pokemon Emerald Randomizer Monotype. I'll see you guys in the next episode. And that will be that. So thank you guys for watching and see you next time. Goodbye everybody.